Hi my sweet people, today's video is on this peanut butter chocolate chip cookies and if you want to know how I made this, do keep on watching. The items you'll need will be peanut butter, brown sugar, egg, chocolate chips, salt, baking soda, and vanilla extract. This recipe I actually found on TikTok and it's not really a chocolate chip cookie because there's no flour involved so you can imagine that it's not going to taste like a normal chocolate chip cookie would but because there's also peanut butter and no flour involved so I wanted to try this out and see how it would turn out. And you can also call this a healthy chocolate chip uh, recipe because of the no flour involved and also with the peanut butter. So it's a very simple and easy recipe with just a few items inside. With me next to you. Let's go to an art museum. I'll explain it at the coffee shop. I know you don't get it, but there's no need to fret it. It's like a gift to devour the thought. No name might be too much, and then go might take a while. But thank you for coming. I know that you're trying to do anything to make me smile. Once you've added in all of the ingredients and mixed it in uh, full and well so you can actually prepare to start baking it and actually on my side this uh, mixture looks different from the video that I've seen because it uh, the cookie also came out different and the, the mixture itself looks different so I'm not sure what was the difference is it the peanut butter or something else maybe the brown sugar or the peanut butter could have made a difference made on the kind of peanut butter and brown sugar I use but uh, nevertheless actually this is a nice uh, recipe but I'd say that it's um, if you're gonna make this it's definitely good to just eat it after you bake it because that's the best um, it tastes best when you have it after baking because I kept it in a airtight container after a while and it didn't taste good at all so I, I had to throw some away because I was the only one eating it but I managed to eat few of it and because I only made half of the original recipe so I didn't really waste that much so if you're gonna make this definitely you have to eat it after it's being baked because after that you're gonna keep it it's not gonna be nice so I'm not sure if refrigerating it it's gonna make it you know last longer or something but if you're gonna keep it in um, room temperature definitely it's not gonna be good so if you are gonna make this definitely eat it straight after you have uh, made it so when I saw the video, actually my mixture is kind of what, like you know, wet and uh, runny. But the other mixture, the the person who made it actually managed to make it uh, into balls, which how normal cookie you can do it. But this was too wet, and I definitely couldn't make it in that way. So um, it, I know it looks funny now, but after you make it, it really it tastes nice and healthy. I would say because of the ingredients and no flour and all that but if you want do try it and let me know how you feel um, because it's just a few ingredients as well and then it's a very simple and quick recipe that you can do so do try it and let me know how you feel thank you so much for watching guys see you guys in my next video bye
She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine. She likes notes that say I love you all the time. Roses at your feet, baby girl, be mine. Baby 